So the very first step in this process is to get a dent pin. The dent pin is an eight digit code that serves as your personal identification number, and you'll actually use the same code later in your career. So later when you apply to dental school, and even when you prepare to take your dental boards. So go to the website you see linked above, and you'll be required to enter some basic personal information. Once your registration is processed, you'll receive an email with your PIN number. We recommend that you use a personal email address for this step rather than a university or a work email address that you might one day lose access to. So now that you have an official dent PIN, you are ready to register for the DAT on the ADA website. This is the step where you will need to pay the non-refundable testing fee, which currently stands at $495, so you do want to be sure that you're committed to taking the test at this point. At this step, you'll also have the option to select all of the schools that you might send your scores to. Many people find this confusing, but there is no extra fee or no limit on the number of schools you can select on this step, so there's really no harm in selecting all of the schools in your country if you choose to do so. It absolutely does not mean you need to apply to all of these schools or send your scores to all of these schools, but you will have the option to do so if you choose to do that in the future. So within a day or two of submitting your application, you should receive an email that looks like this from the ADA. Importantly, you'll see a six month window during which you're eligible to schedule and take your DAT. Okay, finally, on to the most exciting part, actually scheduling your test. So you'll be scheduling your test through the Permetric website. When you're on the Permetric website, first search for ADA under test owner search, then click on ADA American Dental Association. Next, in the left menu bar, under Actions, click Schedule. Here, you can select your country and select the state in which you plan to take the DAT. You'll enter your dent pin in the first four characters of your last name, and then you can select your specific testing center. And from here, you'll be able to view a calendar with all the available dates and times. So now your test date is set and you can focus on actually studying for the DAT. So the next step will be to go and pick a study plan that works for you. So on crackdat.com, we have study packages for one month, three months, and six months of access. So whether your DAT is fairly soon in a month or whether it's at the end of your testing period, we have you covered. We also have study schedules for four, eight, and 12 weeks. And these study schedules are super helpful because they outline day by day, step by step, what you should review and how you should use the resources on the site to help you prepare. So it really helps this process feel much less overwhelming. All right, so that wraps it up. We truly wish you all the best on your DAT. We are really here to help and support in any way we can, and we hope this video was helpful. Thanks for watching.